Welcome back to Algo Trading Series using MB Broker AFL from Market Secrets. In this episode, we will be scripting a strategy for intraday traders to trade the gap ups and gap downs based on open range breakout. This strategy is back testable as well. So before we head into the session, I have one information for you. In addition to this particular series, we are running multiple other series in parallel on algo trading and also on various other trading strategies and investments so please do visit our website www.marketsecrets.in when you are free and check out the content also we are providing multiple data feeds for our users so if you are an active trader you will find it immensely helpful so do visit our website www.marketsecrets.in when you are free to get to know the details and with that note let's jump into today's session so first let's discuss about the strategy this involves gap and range breakout that's why we call it as gap and range breakout strategy so let's begin first let's try to understand the terminologies gap if today's open price is outside the range of yesterday's high or low that is if today's open price is higher than yesterday's high or if it is lower than yesterday's low then our gap condition will be sufficient and when it comes to range breakout we need to calculate the open range of the day using day's high and day's low values after the market opens until a certain period of time so you can select a period of time and after market opens you have to wait that specific period of time and once the time limit is reached you can take the days high and days low at that point in time and use it as a range for that particular day so that's how you have to calculate the range for range breakout so if we want to calculate range till 9 30 a.m then we need to find the high and low range of the first 15 minutes after the market opens so that's how it needs to be done now let's jump into the buy and sell signals for this particular strategy so we need to buy if a stock gaps up or gaps down and the first 15 minute range high is broken on intraday basis so in this case we will buy or go along and we will go short if the stock gaps up or gap down and if it breaks the first 15 minute range on intraday basis so that's when we are going to sort and when it comes to sell we need to sell that is we need to exit the longs if the target is met or if the time limit of 315 is reached so the target for the day in this case will be calculated based on a simple formula so it will be a percentage from entry so we may take one or two percentages from entry as our target likewise the stop loss for the longs will be yesterday's low on the other side when it comes to the sell trade we need to cover that is we need to exit our shots if the target is met or if the time limit of 3 15 pm is reached so target again for this case will be calculated based on the percentage so we will take a percentage from our entry as our exit target so we may take one or two percentages from our entry as our target and we need to use the stop loss for this strategy as yesterday's high so yesterday's high will be your stop loss so now let's move on to the script part when it comes to the script we are just plotting the price first and then we are getting the previous days high low open close values in the variables so that's what we are doing next and then we are checking for gap up and gap down using the built-in functions and in the next two lines we are assigning the breakout time which is 9 30 in this particular case so i'm feeding it as a number here so i'm going to pass the breakout time for calculating the range so uh, 9 30 is my cutoff time and i'm also passing the target values here for example right what would be uh, my target is it one percent ten percent or you know 0.1 percent you can pass it accordingly now in the next set of codes we are taking the high and low of the first 15 minute candle of the day and use it to draw the high and low range of the day so we will take the highs and lows as of 9 30 and we will plot it in our chart so let's go back to the chart so i'm back at the chart now so i'm plotting this particular uh, afl so now if you you know just change the time frame for five minutes so now if you see these uh, you know uh, charts are plotted with 
this particular range so what would be my range at 9 15 for that particular day will be plotted here so if the market had gapped up or gapped down and if the high or low is breach then we will go long or go short accordingly so let's go back to the script now so now comes the buy and sell signal so like i mentioned earlier we will buy if there is a gap up or gap down see we are not just taking the gap up in case of buy we'll also consider gap down so if market gaps and if the time limit set for the trade is not reached for example we will trade only after 9 30 am which is our cutoff time and we will trade only till 3 pm we cannot take any trades after 3 pm so that's my time limit for the trade and then i'm going to check whether the candle has crossed over the range set for the day and if that had happened i'll take a buy and likewise when it comes to the short side i'll check whether there is a gap up or gap down and if the time is above 9 30 am and it is below 3 pm and whether the price crosses the day slow and if that had happened i'll go short and in the next set of codes i'm going to remove the excess signals and then i'm setting the exit signal for the trades so if the target or stop loss is hit for the day i need to exit so that's what i coded here and if the time limit is breached that is if the time has crossed 3 15 pm then i'll auto square off my trades so i'll either wait for a target or stop loss till 3 15 pm and if uh, either stop loss or target is not hit then i'll exit at 3 15 pm so that's what i'll be doing in this two lines of code so we are targeting uh, you know a certain percentage so you can just play around with this numbers here and uh, like I mentioned earlier for long uh, trades I'll consider uh, you know previous days uh, low as uh, my stop loss and uh, for uh, you know so short side trades I'll take uh, previous days high as my stop loss and finally i have also mentioned you know at what price we need to enter the trade once the signal is generated when we should buy so that condition or uh, that particular price range will be plotted in the next set of lines and in the last set we are plotting the different symbols that uh, we generate from the script right so we are plotting it in the chart for easy visibility now let's move on to the back test so i'm sending it this to analysis window so let's see how this particular strategy performs in back test so i'm just running the script now so if you look at here so we got some profits uh, and we got a list of trades so you can just uh, you know play around these settings for example currently we are trading only uh, longs so if you want short trades also you can very well do that so you can uh, you know try back testing the strategy on multiple time frames to arrive at the optimal solution likewise you also can play around the targets and stop losses to ensure that you optimize the strategy before you use it so with that we have come to end of today's episode if you have any queries comments or feedback about this episode the script that we are using or anything about algo trading in general you can reach us anytime so our contact details are available in our website also you can reach out to us through the comment section we'll be happy to help and if you like this video share it with your friends and you know hit the like button as well this will immensely motivate us to do more and more for you and with that note i'm closing today's session thanks for watching have a great day goodbye